Hey, bro, I want you to start doing this. Um, if you go over here on the right here, just make this a favorite, the brush. Make the brush a favorite. So if you hit the star here, it'll show up in your toolbar here. Also, remember, you can make your toolbar disappear by uh, using, hold on a second. Uh, you can't see it right now because I have my recording tool in the way, but if you ever want to make this disappear, there's a little button here. Uh, you can't see it right now. But anyways, so when it's favorited to uh, the brush, use this um, when you have all, all charts selected. Use the brush, and then you can, you can mark important EMA. So like here, EMA 50 here, if you mark it here, you can also see it here, and then you can also see it here. But remember, if you you have to select this crosshair one after because if you keep it on the brush, then everything you draw it'll it'll stay on brush until you pick something else. So go back to this guy here, the crosshairs, and then you can delete. But here, but use this because what's important is, um, for example, EMA resistance or support, like right here. So I said there's an EMA 50 here, but this EMA 50 is also the EMA 200 here in purple. See that? And then when you draw them with this brush, then you can see it on the five minute. Then really our entry, our ideal entry is right here. That look, you can just after the one hour email cross, it makes sense right here on the support the email 200. Then we can use this uh, brush tool to draw the email 200, which is also the EMA 50 on the one hour. But you can see you can just step onto the trade with very little resistance i mean very little risk see this is uh this is what i want students to learn maybe i should keep this recording for a future video okay remember that